Why, hello everybody, Mr. Mario is just standing put on these clouds that look like they have warts or water bubbles. I can't tell exactly what it is from this angle, but when we zoom in, you can see Mr. Mario is ready for action. Hope you guys are ready for action as well. Tackling World 6 here. First off is the Clear Pipe Cruise, which is one of the demo levels from E3 uh, earlier this year that they chose to show off. Now, the reason they did is because this is a world focused on clear pipes, or at least this level is, um, and you'll have a chance to see that. As we move through, and Toad chases this coin. Toad is faster than coins, which is good to know. Now this guy probably has fireballs. Yes, he does. In fact, indeed. Um, and uh, I really loved what I played at E3. I was somebody who thought this game was just fan-freaking-tastic, uh, basically from the get-go. And I'm very happy to report that it's pretty much exactly what I had hoped for. Um, and very cool. So, let me just cruise our way through and do everything we can to survive the day, gather our green stores, and make it straight for the castle. Now you can throw fireballs into these pipes, which is awesome. And then you can do things like that and take out the, uh, take out the opposition. All right, Toad, let's see. What's up here? Eh. Another fire flower. I'll take it, three power up. Just because things have been trickier lately. Um, we're at more of a, we're needing more power ups lately, you know what I mean? Blow him up, and in we go. One up a city is for me. Uh oh. All right, let's fire at these guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chase him, bash him, mash him, bash him. All right, Toad, just do it. Do your worst. Go around again. You can't control which direction they go in the pipe, which is brilliant. Um, it really helps you to avoid messes, avoid deaths, and avoid these crazy hairy people that remind me of creatures from the Mr. Men universe. If you don't know what that is, Google those books. They're old, but they're awesome. Are we really destroying these guys? I feel like they just multiply. They do. They just, they pop back in. Fireballs don't do nothing to them. So we just gotta get out the way. Woo! Two green stars, and we're off to the races. Toad is going through Pipe City. Up in the sky here, World 6 is way above the clouds. We pop out, and now it's time to do some work. Um... How am I gonna? Oh, I gotta get the power box. Okay. All right, here we go. Now up to Daisy, we can travel. Brilliant! Another fire flower for some free power ups. Can I go back? Oh, yes, you can. Okay, nice. Now go up. Yeah. I made it. I made it. I am the main man. Saw a few requests for Toad in the comments. That's why we've uh, trotted him out here. Whoa, I, I took down a fireball with fireball. You can believe that. Let's go to the cloud world. Grab our third green star, I believe, right? Typically, these always house a green star. Unless Toad screws it up. Oh, yes. Piranha plant action. Gotta love the piranha plants. Oh, my God. I was afraid we weren't going to make that jump. Green star. He grabs it for us. Do we get to carry him down with us? No. All right. You can either use fireballs or our feet. Smash all those guys into their seats. In the ground, because they're plants. You know what I mean? All right, let's go over here. Let's just take a quick pass there. Um, because those guys were coming at us. All five unlocks the key box too. What I presume is the end of the level. Um, let's just chase him and follow him around. Oops, a daisy, we go. Good work. Yes. Oh, Captain Toad's in here. What's up, Captain Toad? Can I burn his butt? You can only fire one fireball at a time? Interesting. I kind of want to just bump into him. What's up this way? Whatever. We'll take the golden pipe. I didn't see a stamp in that world. Maybe the stamp was... I thought I went everywhere. Maybe it was hiding under another one of those, uh, the prickly balls, the spike balls we had to somehow figure out how to get. We'll come back for it, no worries. That level was nifty. The clear pipes are cool just because it allows for movement within pipes and also, like, travel through pipes, which is something nobody's ever seen before. Nobody normally just, you go down one pipe, you come up another, and it's like, where, what happened in there? I don't know. Maybe he had kissy time with a dog. I, I wouldn't know. Do you know? Nobody knows. Let's go to Spooky Seasick. Spooky Seasick? Spooky Seasick Wreck. Is this like a 
spooky pirate ship? <gasps> it is! It's a spooky pirate ship in the rain! Welcome aboard the rain train, otherwise known as the rain- Uh-oh, it's a bully. Uh. Bully, you're in Mario 64 and you cause all sorts of trouble. Get off my ship! Get off the ship! Can you come break these things? I just don't- maybe there's a green star in there. No, probably not. Will he go down there? Can I knock him in there? Go in the hole, bully. Hole in bully? Hole in one. Yeah! Knock that bully where he belongs. Put him in the hole. That's my song. Yeah, buddy. Uh-oh. Wobbly bridge, wobbly ship. Oh my goodness gracious. This is intense. And it's a really cool theme, too. I've never seen a Mario level with rain. Has there ever been a Mario rain level? I don't know. I can't think of one. Is there a place to knock these guys? Oh, golly. They can't really hurt you, per se. They just bop you around. Let's see. Can you break them off the level? I just want to know if there's a green... I don't know. There could be a green star, you know, for hitting them off, perhaps. Yes. Good work. See? I love that it rewards your thought process. You know, a lot of these levels have things like, hey, if I did that, maybe? And it seems like there's all, you know, 90% of the time it works out for you, which is cool. I haven't seen any of the, oh, what are they called? Like the prom plants that zoom up, you know what I'm talking about in Super Mario World or some of those games where you get to crawl, climb up the, the like the piranha plant leaf plant. I wish there were some of those. I haven't seen any of those um, at all in the game, which I think would be fun to see. I haven't really been any of those. Shoot, this is all timed all weird. Ouch. Okay, this is interesting. Shoot. No, toadlets! How am I gonna get this thing? Oh, it comes down. Okay. Phew! We made it! Did these guys die from fireballs? No, but there has to be something down there. That's too odd. Aha, a green star down below. I think that's what I smell. I think that's what I see in this creepy sea swell. Go down, Toad Man! Yes, at the bottom of the deck lies a green star charm. Perfecto. Okay. And we've got two. And just like that, we hit the level marker as well, and we've got a big boo here. Oh, gosh. Whoa, tipsy-turvy world. Be careful, Toad Man. Walk like the person you are. Yes, good work. I think we had to make that jump there, otherwise I don't think it would have worked. Yeah. All right, all aboard the bully train. There's many more of them. All right, I'm guessing we have to knock them off in order to reveal something here. Luckily, the fireballs push them back, you know what I mean? If it wasn't for the fireballs, I don't know what I would do. Actually, I would just keep bouncing them. But yes, indeed, it unlocks a block to another dimension. The next dimension of Mario. Look how beautiful this looks. My god, graphics of the year? Seriously now? I, I'm considering it. it. Might not have as many polygons or pixels as the PlayStation 4 or the Xbox One. And that was a horrible jump. But it looks dang gorgeous. And I love the aesthetic. I just, I think... This Mario sheen and shine in total 1080p HD, 60 frames per second is just sexy, so. Thumbs up from the people who built the game. All right, two down, a whole ton to go, and we're almost at 130 green stars. Takes me back to the days of having to get 120 gold stars in uh, Mario 64, which I never did. Never got to see if that Yoshi thing was actually a reality. I still, I, th I know it is, but I still feel like it's not. I don't know. Um, is this 6-3? That's 6-4. Let's do this one, 6-3. I don't know why they would lock 6-3 and have 6-4 be open, but I think they should lock 6-4 and have 6-3 be open. Anyways, this one looks cool. Um, I've had enough toad fill for now. Let's, uh, let's employ the peach mistress. Hands on haul. Uh-oh, we're in like a freaking creepy insane asylum or something. Where are we? It's like we're in Mulan or Naruto or something. <laughs> oh my god. Boomerang. That must be helpful. She's such a cutie. I like how we're using the touchpad here also to like open the door, see what's inside. 
Hey. And there's magic blocks in here. It's a mushroom. Some people think you can't get the mushroom. It really just gives you points. So don't worry about that. I don't know. I thought maybe there'd be a green star back here. No. Okay, just a little opportunity to gather a coin. She's got a fast boomerang throw. Hey. Uh, oh my gosh. I'm pretty sure I hit you. Yeah, big schlub. Give me that fire flower. Change her dress. Make her fancy. Woo! Coin room. I want one of these rooms to accidentally like close the doors and then Mario or like Bowser comes and like eats you alive or something. How crazy would that be? Uh oh. Find door number two is Goomba City. And that guy's a Goomba head. Are you joking me right now? Oh my god, I'm a Goomba! What does this mean? What does this mean? I can jump higher? The heck? I'm a Goomba head. What does this mean? You guys, they don't attack. What's up, guys? Just one of you? It's okay. Do we jump higher? Maybe we don't. I don't know. I'm guessing this power up is that the Goombas don't attack you. Coin purse. Come on now. Come on now, coin purse. Look at that. Goombas don't care. I'm just one of the guys. You care about me? No, you don't. All right. We'll get some more star coins. Oh my god, look how awesome this all looks. How in green earth do I get down there? I say green earth because it's a green star. My boomerang suit would really come in handy right now. I'm sorry for killing you. Okay. I can't get this because I have a Goomba head. I need to get hit. Can you touch me? That sounds weird. Thanks for knocking on my Goomba head. Alright, now. The way that this works is you jump and then... Okay, then you fly up. Okay. Let's hope this works. Oh! Peachy! Peachy Chan doing her work here at the ancient temple. Now these guys hate me. They really do. It's all about how to make Peach scream now, isn't it? Um, another key jam there. If we go down there, probably not a good idea. I'm trying to see where there might be a third star coin. Um, I think there's something in here. Is that guy just being... Are you just being a jerk or what? I think he's just being a jerk. Five! Bingo! There must be some way that would get up in here. I don't know, maybe not. Hey. Is there any way to get up in this guy's little compartment? Eh. Eh. Think I can get on the roof? Yes? Green star me? Secret flagpole, you think? A secret exit? Could this be, or is this the real exit? I think this has got to be a secret exit. I'm gonna try it. Oh, please land on top. Okay, was that a secret exit, you think? I don't know why I feel weird about that, but it was on top of the roof in such a weird place. Was it not? Guess not. That just seems so odd. Okay. Well, maybe when we go back, we'll try the other route where I'm going back for the green stars and see. I just had this sneaking suspicion something was up because it was like I, I flew up there on my own, you know? Deep jungle drift. Donkey Kong gonna appear? I'd love to see a Donkey Kong cameo. How happy would that make me? Very, very happy is the answer to your question. Alright. There's moving things. Kitty cat suit. Climb me to the top, baby. Green star? Nope. Come on, kitty. Oh my god, we just... 
dodged a big bullet. Luckily, Peach does have her little hang glide thing. That helps so much. Wee! Wee! Alright, we're like skipping over everything. I'm hoping this leads us to something awesome, though. Because otherwise, there'll be no way to get this stamp. I'm afraid, though. Oh, it's not like a, a time movement stage, is it? Is it? Is there another one of these rafts coming? Yes, okay, good. I to say, like, I don't want to miss out the whole level, you know? Come on, B-Man. That's the first green star, and I died. All right, well, now we have a little sensibility about what's going on here. Okay, so the stamp is up top. Um, what's interesting about this game is they choose to not let you, like, retain any of your stuff unless you hit a checkpoint, specifically. So, like, what I mean is you don't keep the stamp. I'm sure you guys have seen this, but you don't keep the stamp uh, just because you got it once. You really have to get it every time in order to, to be considered a victor. Oh, God. Whew. That was a close call. I like Peach's little cat cat wiggle here. Um, and let's make sure that we go through that pipe, not at our first opportunity, but at our best opportunity. I do want to get the stamp, though, because there's no way to get the stamp from the lower place. Okay, now, I think we're safe. Yeah, buddy. Okay, good work. Star and stamp and beautiful purple bog swamp thing. Let's get this checkpoint to guarantee our capture of those devices. All right. I wish we had a free camera here. We don't we only have a couple angles, which is interesting. All right. Whoa! Got no spinny. Okay. Ah! Gotcha! Oh gosh, I almost fell. Stay up here. Let's wait for the next bridge brigade to come through. The log ride, it's like the freaking Splash Mountain of Mario here. Except, oh, wouldn't that be awesome if there was a big waterfall? I was gonna say, except there's no big drop, but but what if there was a big drop? How dang cool would that be? Can I get in there? Aha! Uh -huh. Tiny cats roaming play, getting all the coins today, today. Smack back at you. Smack back at you. All right. Wait for me, Raft Man. And there is a drop. Goodness gracious, I predicted it again. All right. Wee! Little cat sitting so pretty. She even has earrings. How the heck am I gonna get up there? Yes. Baby. Good work, Kitty Cat Peach. Uh. Victory is for us. That's what I say. Ooh! Almost got all the coins. Missed that one right there. But hey, it's alright. No harm done. No foul play. Victory is the name that we reserve today. Course clear. Good work. Feeling pretty proud of that. Another stamp. It's a sleeping kitty toad. And we beat 6-4. Looks like there is quite the nasty uh, Mohawk Bully encounter coming up when we return. Until the time, guys and girls, hope you have a fantastic day. If you're enjoying the series, smash that like button. If you love Mario as much as me, add to your favorites. Leave a comment let me know your favorite world so far. We've done pretty pretty awesome in this uh, in this world. Um, even last time we did pretty good. I'll show you real fast. Whoops. You'll see that in World 5. We were nearly perfect, so we're shaping up to uh, really score some big wins here, and that is what we'll do when we return. Until then, everybody, thanks again for watching. Fantastic day. Drink some hot chocolate. We'll see you all later.